Brian, before I share my vows, I just wanted to thank you for being my best and most supportive friend, for always treating me with love, trust, and respect, and for your constant understanding, patience, and daily dose of wit that keeps me smiling even on the toughest days. This horizon, it's shining. We were living in Los Angeles when I realized my home wasn't a physical place back in Chicago anymore. My home was just simply being with you. It doesn't matter where we are or where we're going. You fill my heart with light and a sense that everything is good and will be good as long as we're together. All the world is ours to take. Frankie, I would like to start by saying thank you for giving me that Band-Aid. It's a tale that your brother has made fun of me countless times for, but I'm so glad that I met you. It feels like just yesterday I was a medical student in Chicago walking through the halls of the hospital checking you out. <laughs> Little did I know I had found my best friend and the love of my life. Brian, I never thought that there would be anyone worthy enough for my daughter until I got to know you. I have no doubt that you will love her unconditionally and look out for her just as I have through all these years. It is an honor to have you and your wonderful family join our family and we look forward to many years of good times and making memories. I feel like the luckiest girl in the world that you chose me to spend the rest of your life with. My hope is that I can be everything you deserve, desire and more. celebrating the marriage of my daughter Frankie to one of the finest gentlemen I have ever known. I pronounce you to each other, husband and wife. Would you like to kiss your bride? I know that when Frankie met you, she saw love in your eyes and she found a home in your heart.
the moment you met Brian, I knew he was the one. I could see how your face lit up, and every time you talked about him, how excited you got when you were around him, and how perfectly compatible you two are. Frankie, I, I don't know what I can say that I haven't said before. You'll always be my little girl, and I love you more than words can express, and I am so proud of the woman that you have become. wonderful partner to share the rest of your life with and for that I am extremely fortunate. So please raise your glass for a toast to Frankie and my new son-in-law Brian.